This is Spoken by Elswith, the Femdom Hypnosis Podcast with useful training for the submissive man. Welcome to Day 40. Yesterday, I gave you the gift of denial and feeling my control over you. Your task was to let me know what you did with that... (laughs) With that, um, found free time. Uh, for today, I figured I would let you know, um, like two scenarios that were shared with me a while ago, uh, by another top of ways that she found to fill up her submissive man's free time. Um, (laughs) if, if, you decide to do one or both of these scenarios, go ahead, but I do want proof. So one of them included providing a shopping list and exactly which store to use. Now for those of you in the States, it'd likely be a Walmart because God knows (laughs) there's usually nothing busier than the Walmart. Um, For those of you outside of the States, Uh, I would say be that corner shop that's frequented by many people stopping in during the lunch break and, you know, the after work crowd. So, you got the shop, right? And now you need the list. What do you think is on the submissive man shopping list? I bet my clever one will figure it out by the time I get to the second item. There's only four. Item one. Cucumber. Item two. Lube. Item three. Condoms. And item four. Well, this isn't something you can buy. It's just a strong sense of devotion. So this is one of the tasks, and it required a receipt as proof. Now does the idea turn you red? Or are you one of those that would have absolutely no hesitation to shop for anything, anywhere, anytime? How about this scenario? For my fellow gym goers who frequent shared showers or perhaps swimming laps. While I adore the feeling of a tanning bed, (laughs) they've yet to make them without significant risk. And you know, I'm not risking you for something as trivial as a tan. So instead, this two-part devotion challenge, um, (laughs) Yeah, it kind of turns into a three-part one. It requires, one, a bra. Now, it can be a sports bra, a fancy bra, a bralette, whatever you feel you could wear to go to step two, a spray tanning location. Now, some of these do have the booths where you can just, like, walk in and do it, so nobody's going to watch what you're up to. Um... (laughs) but others don't (laughs) and then um, heck well step three is just this you you have proof of your devotion every time you go for your swim or a gym trip or you know a shared locker room until the tan wears off of course and the tan lines are gone So which one sounds easier? Or does that even matter? You want to know which I want, right? Well, the truth is, (laughs) for today, uh, for today's release, my dear man, you would be my rope bunny, tied in a delightful, decadent way to show off your finer bits, and then jerked off by me, 
till I decide I'm done. One orgasm, two, whatever. How many feel possible for today? Probably more than you can imagine. Because yesterday you didn't release, did you? See you tomorrow.